So there's a bit on the map which shows like an open space of field like this but in order to get to it there's like a field so, there, then. so that so you've got the main road and there's like a bit where you can't it looks like you can't get on it um like like there's a there's a padlocked gate and you go through that and there's another set of gates that are unlocked that are locked as well but there's a side path and as a dog walker come on there's like for a very long time now from where i live when you can when you see it from elland you can see in the very landscape of like right here where i am there's like a like sort of like etching into the ground it's all white and made up of like all together what a flipping view <laughs> what that was worth that was worth coming towards to try find but it's somewhere like round here that it is here like i don't know where it would be but this is a public footpath and it looks really nice i've never actually walked on here before like the like the whole time i've lived in elland uh I've never actually lived, like, walked on here. Right, so if I walk just straight on, I know it's a bit deeper. It's, like, I would have thought it would be like on here. Oh my god, I can see books from school. <sighs> oh, one of the leaves has fallen off. <clears throat> oh my god, that's a drop. That is a sheer drop. Look at that. Around here somewhere because when you see it from like the landscape uh, like all the way down there you see like the white on the on the on the, uh, on the floor don't see it just yet I might find it hopefully well it's not a bad view is it wow look at that such a nice view and that's Halifax in the distance where I'll be in a very short amount of hours I think I got a little bit lost um, with like going which way, to, which way to try and go I'm just going to step away from here because it's bramble, not brambles nettles are not, they're not nettles are they? the barbed wire all over Holly come away Holly come away uh, I was like, I'm not sure where I was. I was like, oh no, where am I? Uh, like that way is still, I'm still at the top of Elland. But I don't know if you can hear it. If you can hear the traffic. Uh, but that way is the dual carriageway. <whistles> and um, like looking that way, like straight that way. I think it does go straight into Elland. I'm pretty sure it does because I'm just trying to remember. Like the last time I did this way, I, I recognise where I am now. But like, I went this way before with my dad. And it was a while ago. Holly, Chester, come up. There are cows in the field. Down there. Good dogs. So we have only one option. And that is to go my left and go along to the entrance to where the dual carriageway is it, it is safe it's safe i know because i know where i am now but like i'll have to put the dogs on the leads because even though it is a path next to the dual carriageway there's a lot of traffic and having the, my dogs off would not be very safe not really Yep, I know where I am. It's been a while since I've vlogged. I'm gonna be honest, it's been a while. Um, reason is, just not being interested. Honestly, to be fair, really. 
just wanted a break. Simple as like, like that's just a simple solution. Like it's simple. Like whenever you see this, when I, whatever it is, I don't know. Uh, it's just simple. Like need a break. And while I do like put videos up whenever I like, that's kind of the privilege of uploading that much videos to my channel and that the private. So this is whenever like, it's like, oh, I fancy releasing that today. I can then release it and then release that the next day whilst at the same time having a break from vlogging. Uh, it's nice. It's nice to kind of do like, because while it seems like I'm not having a break in that sense, like, all oh, right, Jamie's just uploading consistently, like whether it be every one or two days or every three to four days, or whether it be I upload one day, do one day, then the next day, then the next day, then have a couple of days off, it might seem like I'm not having a selection. Like, it seems like I'm not having a day, like the break. But actually I'm and it's quite nice to take some time off like like I've had some time off work um, like I had so I had Wednesday and Thursday off and I should actually be working today but I've actually scheduled it so I've actually got a day off So, cutting to here, um, I actually couldn't think of anything else to say after that point. Uh, also, not to not to mention as well, my phone crashed a little. Like it was, just, it was like this screen, like this, but it was just stayed. It was just frozen on my phone. I was like, no way. So today, really, this is like the second time of going out. So yeah, as I was saying, like. I should be working today, 11.6.45, but, do you know honestly, like, with plans that come out in the way, that come out with family and such, like, I couldn't have worked today, so, it's not like, oh, damn it, I've just not turned up or anything, it's organised, someone's took that shift anyway, so it's like, well, it's not, it's, it's, it's like, it's not no one doing it. I just hope it's not a freaking crew member that goes in the kitchen. Because, listen, on the 10th of October at work, so I don't know if I'm going to be working that day or not, uh, there's going to be a crew meeting. And I've wrote some stuff down. To go to talk to it, to talk in it. Now the thing is, if I can't go to it, and I am in work and I want to go to it, or I'm just not even working that day, to be fair. Uh, what I want to do, take my points, put them across into a video, then, as I'm not there, share my video with the group and do that. Look how blue the sky is. And I'm wearing a jumper. Am I a dick or not? No, I am. Uh, but it's cold. Blue sky, everything looks really nice. It's actually quite cold uh, and windy, so if I do get warm, all I need to do is just take it off. And then that's it. Just take it off. Um, I've not really got an idea where to walk, to be fair. Although, I kind of have an idea. So a couple of days ago, I got dropped off at Blackley with the dogs and I was doing a little bit of filming. Don't know if I'm gonna use it because there was no real point of it because it didn't go anywhere. But uh, from, from Ireland, there's like a massive hill, which is where I was filming. And on top of it is like some like white sculpture that looks like birds. And uh, there's like three ways you can go. So there's like a path that goes down back to Holland, which I've been down a few times. There's the path I went across, which was like a flat grassland. 
and there's like a third path which was not which was there to be found which I didn't go along it was like some dirt path which was like goes like that and end up going like that way so I'm thinking because it's nice and there's no real need to be inside because well I've been not really doing much to be fair apart from watching TV um let's go find him like let's go up to him and yeah basically like the problem the thing is when I went previously I didn't see it because there's like it's on a, it's on a steep banking and if you're from the top and you're all trying to look down it's a challenge so if you're further down looking up it should be more visible I mean that's just hopefully hopefully that's the case okay so I need to go that way okay so I need to go that way you can just see the cars ever so slightly that's the road and turn right but before I go that way one blue sky and that's where I've just come from holy cow it's not even that far but I'm so lucky and privileged that I don't have to come far to witness such a nice view. I mean, if I was on the other side, going to like Old Lindley Way, which is like the opposite side where I'm pointing, you get an equal nice view from the top as well. I'm pretty sure I've like got to the top there. I've vlogged this like side here, like vlogged this side. Oh. Brought a drink with me, thankfully. So, wanna go this way? Turn right, turn right that way. Uh, and carry on. Hey, Holly. Where is he? Oh, Chester. Hi, yeah. So, I can go straight on, but what I'm gonna do is turn left here. I'm gonna look at how if the housing's has changed and what's the point if there's any construction that's changed because the last time I came here uh, well there was a massive pile of like rubble and everything just walking along like <laughs> as I was walking along seeing like a massive pile of rubble and like all the construction diggers so I want to see if anything's changed since the last time I came up here plus as well going that way is kind of a little shortcut to where I want to get to anyway. So let's go. So this bit of road needs working on because that's correct. That's that's it fully done. But it's like just like that still. And there's still construction going on here. And housing is still under repair. My god. This is a long construction build. Still not finished. So, as you can see, up there, big boulder f fences, and it's the same like 100 metres further up, or however far it is. And then you've got all this fencing to like say, oh no, you can't come this way. But this is the thing I like public footpath, right? Never even noticed this. I can't see really because of the sun, so I'm going to go closer to it. It's so sunny, you can't really see. But look, can I? Oh, I need to get this way. It's not easy vlogging when you've got two dogs and it's dead sunny. But basically, I don't know. Anyway, here is, there we go, found it. That was not easy. When you're looking at the sun, it's not easy. Public footpath, <sighs> that was not easy. Although, never mind as well about that. Uh, that's where I've just come from. And remember about the, f the fence from here? Look at that, that's the gap. That we went before. God, just try to get the angle right. So that's for that. I'm proper sweating. 
Jesus Christ. Whew. Trying to get the angles right when it's really sunny is not easy. It's really not. I mean, you want to get the footage that you want, but then again, you don't want to get blinded. And we're actually being blind. So that's the way I went before. This is the way I think you can go. Well, according to a map, like when I went that other way, it didn't go anywhere. But saying that, looking at this now, it looks like a path because if you look at how stood it, how, how stood upon it looks, I think you can. Is that a path? Let's go have a look. I might fall doing this, and there's nettles everywhere. It's, it is really sunny. I don't know where I'm going. Can't even see a thing because it's really sunny. Well, it's a dead end. Yeah, I don't think you can get that way. Right, come on, go back. Well, I'm not gonna lie, this looks like a path to me. Like, on up there, it doesn't look like there's a path because it's all there, uh, deep hedges and etc. But it certainly looks like one because, like, regarding where people have walked or driven down it, uh, like, you see, like, loads of vegetation on that side, but you don't see as much in the middle. It's all, like, being stood on. So yeah, this looks the correct way that I wanted to go previously. That other way was a dead end. Uh, nice one for trying, but it goes nowhere. But I just want to stop and show you the view. So is it worth it? Coming up, getting burnt, sunny, will it been sunny, getting sweaty? Well, I've not found that other thing yet, so I need to find out on that theory first. If I can find it, then, yeah, that'd be good. So that's Elland. Yeah. Wow. We're not even, we're so high up. That's the thing, we're so high up, and I kind of like where we've got to. Yeah, there are loads of different paths, like heading down to the left, and I'm like, I don't really want to try that because they look so vertically steep. And you know, also as well, I'm looking, trying to find this sculpture that's in the in like in the ground, but I'm thinking because it's so overgrown because of how warm it's been, I think it's just literally been covered up because it would literally be in amongst that but you don't see it because it's so so overgrown with with plants and etc which is a shame but if I come back here again and it's less grown and it's like when it gets colder and it's like turns well as I said colder I might try again So according to the map, that is the location. Somewhere within that is that little white sculpture in the ground. Now, not gonna lie, pretty overgrown, isn't it? So uh, I don't think I'm gonna get in there. Yeah, that sucks. So uh, I mean, while I have come here for nice scenery, which is true, but to try find that when it was so overgrown, yeah, didn't really work. So that way goes to a dead end, and you can't get off that field. So this is a complete dead end path. So you can't go that way. So I'm walking the way I came, and then gonna go into Welland. Or just practically walk back down the hill. <sighs> back home. Yeah, that's what I'll do. So 
so I'm having a sit down and a rest because when you're walking in the sun and there's no shade, there's no cover, there's no clouds in the sky hardly and it's all blue sky as it looks really nice but coming back up it was just sheer, sheer sun blasting down it's nice just to sit here I don't I think I've actually ever sat here and did a, do, done a vlog before like so you've got this, these two fences here and this boulder that I'm sat on and like as you go further up it's a fence and it's all boarded off so you, so you can't get a vehicle on here that's that's good to know that's good to know you can't get a vehicle on along here because it's all boarded up and then this is pretty this is a pretty big stone which is going to take a lot of construction to move it so it's a, so it's well protected from vehicles which I guess at one point there was people who just drove along here and just dicked about so I can understand why they fenced it all off and plus as well that bit down there is private property um, so private housing so I can understand them not wanting the noise from loonies just driving along here so it's nice to have some quiet actually I say that and then there's a car that comes by so yeah, just like I'm just taking some time, just chilling, might have a drink, give these some a drink and then set off again and I mean I'm not going for distance at all. I'm really not. Like I've been out an hour and twelve minutes and I've done two point six miles. So pace I'm pacing it because my pace would be three to four miles in an hour. Not really bothered to be fair about pace doing that stuff now. So when it comes, even when it does come to like October and it's like the 200k, I'm just gonna casually walk and enjoy myself and not like, like walk like an idiot and do myself injuries, which I don't want. You know, it's nice as well because I don't think anyone comes here as well. So it's like my own like little personal sanctuary. Like that literally is the main road, but like just here, it's just so nice to like spend time. I think it's, I've never actually seen anyone on here before. I think it's just me. <sighs> yeah. So enough of that. So see you whatever I record next. I just feel so chilled up here. Like, I know the fence doesn't add um, points to the view, but all I need to do is that, and then it's just as nice. Yeah. Hey, yeah. So my, I'm, my dogs are just chilling. Yeah. Hey, you boy. Hey, puppy. And that's where, that's the main road going up to Ainley Top. And the thing is, like, I'm literally not far away from there, but I've, I'm so safe having the dogs off here. They're going to have to go on again at some, like, again now, because we're going that way. We're going, I'm not going to point because it's out of focus. So I'm going to go this way and turn left and then back along the way we came, really. So I'm currently in Blackley still. Um, one thing I've never actually done is the cemetery slash graveyard. So so many times as I've been coming down the hill, up or down it, and I've seen the church, and there's a little graveyard or cemetery. I've never actually gone into it. Um, apart from now, I'm literally just exploring uh, here. I don't think it's very big. But I've got to admit something right now. It's quiet. It's still quiet. Um, yeah, like surprisingly quiet. And there's like a bench here that I've just seen. There's a pathway down there. I think the best way to explore it would be alone. Because I've got my dogs with me and they're just going to pull me like mad. And wherever I want to go, I can't go. So, I mean, this looks really nice. Like, it's so random, like, I mean, yeah, you see a church, there's going to be a, a 
a graveyard or somewhat like a cemetery next to it. I think what I'm going to do is when I come, I, go, I want to come back here when it's less sunny and like alone because because I can't do this. I can't. It's really difficult because I can't like walk here on my own because it's such a challenge. I don't even know where this goes. It's a dead end. So I want to come back here and I'm going to come alone and I'm going to come when it's darker because there's no way in hell I'm going to be able to explore this place where I've got my two dogs with me because uh, I ain't going to manage. Did I not stop it? Oh, now I am. So that's where we're going to go now. I think we might go. On, we might actually go in the field. Yeah, we might actually do that. That's a good idea. So fast forward a few hours until, well, not until since the war that I've just been on. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so yeah, that was nice to, well, not get lost in Blackley again. Um, and also it wasn't the tech. I'm very blurry right now. There we go. Okay, so. Tired from that. Tired from the food. Tired from the f what? I'm tired. Do you know, it just don't. I said food because Ryan just texted me about something going on in Halifax tomorrow. Um, so basically. Tomorrow, I'm going to have a free day, so I'm doing 7-2 shift, and I found out that my parents won't be back till like late in the evening, so even if I finish at 2 and do some stuff with Ryan in the afternoon, come back, and then have some time on my own, uh, my idea tomorrow is 7-2 shift, so I could actually, on my break, go out, uh, on my break, and basically go around Halifax on a break. Uh, there's something called Chow Down going on, which Ryan's just messaged me about, so we could go go look at that. So the thing is, on my break, there's that to go. That I could do that. Then on as I come back off my break, I can say to people, "Hey, if you're coming to Halifax, you could also go to Chow Down as well, uh, and then maybe go see a film, then come back home." And then there's the church that I was just at previously and go there and spend some time there. 